Hello everybody. I wanted to um, make a quick video to say thank you and explain what my journey has been like working with As, As You Wish Publishing. Uh, Kira and Todd have asked if I will share what my journey was like as a solo author. So I'll walk you through some of the benefits that I've received. Uh, I have to be really honest, I didn't take a lot of time to look for a publisher. I, I had the idea last year, it's weird to think I didn't even have the idea a year ago, but last year in late March, I had the idea of writing a book and I was in Mexico at the time and I started to Google publishers and I had all these different websites and then ads popping up and I was overwhelmed and I didn't really know where to start. So I, I essentially started and stopped. And fast forward, I had been to a conference with Celebrate Your Life and within those same few weeks, Kira popped on and mentioned her publishing company and invited people to join uh, as a collaborative author. So I did that first so that I would understand the publishing world a little bit more. And then in the back of my mind, I knew it was time, but I was, I was waiting. And then one night, uh, a Facebook post came out from Todd, I believe, that said, if you sign up now, you, you save a little bit of money. And I basically grabbed my credit card and signed up and thought, oh my goodness, what have I just done? I just committed to writing a book. So, and, and now I have a book. So here we are, uh, I guess about almost a year later, and uh, my book, Beyond Hello, Rekindling the Human Spirit, One Conversation at a Time. Uh, it launched in November. I should, I'm actually at work in my office. I'm also a school principal, but hang on, I will show you. Goodbye. <laughs> I'm back. I have some here. So this is my book. And um, it tells the story of my students and I over 10 years helping people reconnect, um, helping our homeless community reconnect with family they've lost touch with. And so in retrospect, I am so happy that I went with As You Wish Publishing because I had never written a book before. I had ideas and I had stories, but I didn't really know how to put them together. I was, I was writing in a creative lens of just sitting down and typing. And um, once I signed up, Todd said to me, I need your timeline. And I thought, I don't have a timeline and so, uh, or an outline. So to be honest, I only made it to, because Todd asked for one. I really didn't see it as being um, a benefit to me at the time, but oh my goodness, tips like their videos as well as their um, suggestion I hand in my outline were game changers because once I went through the steps using their knowledge, I was able to see my book unfold and I was able to write so much faster. And, and so all the way along, any time I had questions, I would send a message to Kira or Todd and I would have an answer often within minutes, but always within a day. And they were with me throughout the whole process, um, through the writing, the editing, the cover, the, I was a little bit challenging with the cover. I'm sorry, I was a bit picky, but we got there. Um, and through all the ups and downs, not only did they offer um, guidance, they were just really human and we learned together through some, some things. And, and I didn't just gain the publishing um, experience, I also gained some friendships. So if you are thinking about being a solo author, first of all, I encourage you to do it. My life has changed significantly. Not only have uh, we been able to sell, I don't know who we is, and well, I guess uh, Kira and Todd have helped me. So we um, have sold just over 1,200 copies in the first three months, uh, and I've been able to donate the proceeds of each book um, buys a meal for somebody living on the street. So I've been able to, to give more in my community. Um, I, it has just opened up my world for speaking engagements. I, my book is now um, in three different book clubs. It's available in all different stores in Vancouver, um, Indigo, and online at Amazon. But above the sales, it's really introduced me to a ton of new people. I was just counting this morning. I had a request um, today to speak at, at a conference and, and another one yesterday. And it's so weird that I'm actually in the place now that I have to consider, can I fit that into my schedule? Because when I made a list this morning, I've said yes to nine upcoming speaking engagements. And I need to find that balance of now choosing which ones to say say yes to so that just seems bizarre because a year ago i would have 
you know, not really even known where to start to find those opportunities. So if you are thinking about writing your book, first of all, go ahead and do it. I encourage you, if you have questions, you can always reach out and ask me. I really thought that once I hit submit, I would open myself up to a world of judgment. That hasn't been the case. I think that was just my own self-doubt. And um, it really led to uh, the opportunity to do so many more things I love with um, involving my students, with speaking, uh, with helping in our community. And, um, and I just, I loved the process of writing. So if you have questions, please ask. And if you're not sure which publisher to go with, you need to go with As You Wish Publishing. That's, that's just the best advice I have for you. So thanks, Kira. Thank you, Todd. And I hope this video helps. Take care.